welcome back to the channel guys it is me ad744 so today guys we do our champions league playoff round predictions guys so we have the playoff games confirmed all the matches except one match did not take place which is of course dynamo zygrib versus ak athens that will take place at a later time at saturday august 19th at 2 45 p.m eastern time so we will do that match as a separate prediction so i'll have that video separately um and so like i said guys the matches will take place next week respectively in the week after and of course the winner of the matches of course Ma qualifies to the champions league and the losers go to the europa league group stage now before we even get to the playoff round let's go look at how many i got correct in the third qualifying round so there were a total of nine matchups and let's see if i can get at least five of them correct okay so let's start with the first one which you got is raquel versus iris limazol now I do apologize, and it, I do apologize because someone actually did point out to me in the comment section below that I believe I said Eris is a Greece team when they're not from Greece; they're from Cyprus. So I do apologize in advance. I really didn't mean to offend anyone. That I didn't really mean to offend any Eris fans. It was just my error on my part. So thank you for correcting me that in the comment section below. That's the beauty of the comments, guys. You guys can help me educate myself because you know, obviously, as creators, we sometimes make mistakes, and you guys. Um, can clarify for us so that's why I encourage you guys to comment on the video guys and of course I take the time to read through every comment even if I don't reply to the comment I still read them you know I heart them I heart generally most of the comments and reply to most of the comments generally or I heart and I, I, I interact with the comment in some way or form most of the comments at least anyways I believe I predicted Rocco to advance and they did advance so happy with that one I'm one for one so far then we have Slovan Batisavle versus Makaibe Okay, I'm trying to make sure I got this one right. My Kaiba Haifa. I believe that's how you pronounce. I'm, I'm trying my best to pronounce these names in a better way because I know my pronunciation has been great. So let me try this again. My Kaiba Haifa. Okay, so I believe I predicted them to advance and they did advance. So I got two for two. Dan Bozarga versus AK Athens. We cannot tell what's going to happen. I'm going to have to wait until Saturday to see if I got that one right. So we'll save that for another time. The Olympia. Versus Galatasaray, I believe I predicted Galatasaray to advance, and they did in stunning fashion. Then I believe we have Copenhagen versus Sparta Park. I did say this would be a close match, and I did say Copenhagen to advance. So, so far, my predictions have been pretty spot on. And then, of course, I messed up with this one. I I, I went with KI versus Mold. I predicted KI to advance uh, on the virtue of what they did against Hacken. And Mold advanced 2-0 in the second leg after extra time, and they advanced to the playoff round. And then for the league path, I we have Braga versus TSC. I believe I predicted Braga to advance. Rangers versus Servette. I believe I predicted Rangers to advance. And then this one's a really tricky one to pronounce. So I think I, um, let me try to see if I can get this one right. Pi, Pi not the, Pi not the Oh my god! I dude, I I swear I okay. Let me try this again. Pi, Panathinaikos, Panathinaikos. Yeah, I think that's how you do it. Pi not the kinos. It's it's a very hard name to pronounce. Basically, um, I think the abbreviation is poke. So I'll just probably just call him the poke just to abbreviate because it's so difficult to pronounce. Anyways, they defeated Marseille on penalties, and Marseille, man, they should be looking at themselves like, yeah, that was very disappointing for them. Gwen Doozy, man, you got some blood in your hands. Then we have PSV Eindhoven versus Stromgras. I predicted PSV to advance. So. Basically, the predictions have been pretty good. I only messed up with two predictions, guys. And it was very close ones, too. It wasn't like I was really, really off. Like, I these calls were sensible calls. So, out of a total of... Uh, there's actually 10 matchups, what am I saying? <laughs> um, I got six. I got 8 out of 10. I'm uh, sorry, it's 7 out of 9. Because we don't know about the Dynamo Zyke of AK Athens one. So, we'll have to see in that one. Now, let's go look at the playoff round predictions. So, let's start with the first one is... My Kaiba Haifa versus Young Boys. I'm going to go with my Kaiba Haifa to advance. I feel like for me with Young Boys, yes, they have been great. I think they have been fantastic. You know, of course, they won their um Swiss League, of course. I just feel so though that this my Kaiba Haifa team is just something special. Like, what they did last season in the Champions League was phenomenal. And yes, even though Young Boys have the second leg at home, I feel like they have my Kaiba my Kaiba. Haifa is just too strong, and I feel like they'll win the first leg, and I think that's going to cost them. If Young Boys can escape from Israel with a draw, 
then I think they're in great position. They have to try to get a result on first leg because if they lose, I think it's really over for them. Um, so yeah. And the next up is Raquel versus Copenhagen. Um, this is another very tricky one to call. I am gonna go with Copenhagen to advance. I feel like for me, Rocco, they are a great team, but I feel like the fact that I just I just feel like Copenhagen for me, they just know how to get it done. Like even if they don't play well, they can grind out the result. And the second leg being at home, I think is a huge advantage. And I feel like that the home field advantage will be great. I just don't really trust the Polish teams away, and that's why I have Copenhagen to advance. Then we have Mold versus Galatasaray. Probably the one of the most interesting matchups in the round. Maybe the closest matchup of the round. I'm going to go Galatasaray, though. I think Galatasaray, what they, their team is insane. I mean, you have Icardi on the team. You have Muslera um, as well. And the team is just stacked, you know, with so many incredible players. And, of course, they won the Turkish League last season. I think those should do it. Mold, I, I, I commend them for what they did against KI. But I feel like... They should have, uh, like, honestly, like, it took them a while to beat them. You know, they had to grind through extra time. And Galatas, they didn't have extra time, you know. And so I think Galatas will be more match fit for this game anyway. So, yeah. And then we have Rangers versus PSV, man. Can PSV get revenge for what happened last season the Champions League qualifiers? Because, of course, as we all know, guys, Rangers actually defeated PSV. And this time around, guys, I am actually going with PSV to get revenge. I think PSV have a better team than they had in that time. And I just feel like Rangers have digressed. I don't think Rangers have been as good as they were. And I feel like Rangers just haven't really been great. And I think the additions up, you know, um, Ricardo Pepe, then obviously Noah Lang as well. And I think the second leg being at home is great advantage. Even though that was true for the last time, I think PSV will just find a way to do it. I don't think Rangers are as good as they were. And yeah. Are they Braga versus... Pa I, 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 let me try this again. Braga versus Panathikainos. Pan or Pock. Okay, we'll just call them POC. Just it's just so hard to pronounce the name. I'm I'm really trying my best, guys. I'm not trying to intentionally mispronounce. I'm gonna go Braga to advance. I respect what they did against Marseille. They were fantastic, Pock. But I feel like for me, they they I feel like Braga just have so much quality, you know. And I feel like Braga is one of the most underrated teams in European football. And I feel like this team they are good, but I feel like. I feel like they need to win the first leg. And I don't see them winning the first leg like they did against Marseille. We know Marseille have a tap habit of disappointing. And I don't think Braga will disappoint as much as Marseille did. So, that was my predictions, guys. I'm going to be interested to see how many I can get correct of the six teams, guys. It should be very fascinating. I want to know your predictions in the comments below, guys. And like I said, guys, please uh, give me your predictions. And like I said, guys, I'm trying my absolute best with the pronunciation. Some of these names are very difficult to pronounce. And it's not like I'm trying to mispronounce them intentionally, you know. It's just that I it's just hard to pronounce. Okay, guys. So I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Let me know your guys' thoughts in the comments below. Guys, remember guys to like and subscribe. And yeah, guys, I'll see you guys later, man. Peace out.